our viewer question today is about cookware. And they have asked uh, if there's a particular type, um, and this includes stovetop and, you know, cooking in the oven, um, if there's a type that's, you know, with all the different coatings and materials, um, if there's one that you recommend that is like the best or the healthiest for cooking. Right. Well, I'm old enough to remember when Teflon coated frying pans first came out. And what an amazing advance this was. This is tetrafluoroethylene. <laughs> this is polytetrafluoroethylene, P-T-F-E. Uh, and uh, uh, polytetrafluoroethylene, right? Uh, P-T-F-E. And this is Teflon. And we all know things don't stick to Teflon pans. But uh, lately, we found out that especially uh, if you leave that uh, skillet on the stove and walk away and it heats up to 400 degrees, 500 degrees, uh, the Teflon starts breaking down and, and uh, various hydrocarbon molecules start coming off that are not good uh, to eat or inhale. And so Teflon per se has fallen out of uh, favor. And most of it, uh, most of the coatings, all the ones that I know of uh, really are now uh, are to be avoided. They all seem to outguess. So that brings us back to grandma's kitchen, uh, which has gone a little high tech, now, but basically you want a good solid metal skeleton of the pan. That should be either cast iron uh, or nowadays you want the really high grade surgical stainless steel. Uh, and those are gonna be very inert, um, but uh, the uh, but a little caveat on the cast iron. The, the, uh, the surgical steel ones are real, they're expensive, but they're, they, they are, are quite inert and quite safe to cook with. The cast iron ones, are, they're, they're wonderful, but you've got to have them coated not with Teflon, uh, but you want to coat it either with ceramic uh, covering, which is glass basically, uh, or a really uh, temperature resistant enamel. So you want either enamel coated cast iron or ceramic coated cast iron or uh, the surgical stainless steel. Yeah, ones. Those are, would be by far the most inert and safe. Now, I would recommend uh, people go to my friend and colleague Ocean Robbins, their foodrevolution.org. Go to foodrevolution.org and do a search on safe cookware. And they, they have an extensive article and they go into all the various types and makes and things you, uh, you should look for and things to avoid. Uh, so go to foodrevolution.org and check out their safe cookware. But by and large, I go with either surgical stainless steel or um, a coated uh, cast iron, coated with either enamel or ceramics. Uh, I'm not a cook, but uh, that's the, from the scientific point of view, that's what, uh, uh, that's what uh, seems to be the safest. But if you buy a certain product and, and you complain that, that your, your, tofu, your scrambled tofu sticks to the bottom of the pan, uh, well, before you get in yourself in that situation, do some research uh, to get the most inert nonstick surfaces that are available, but lots of them out there. Hope that helps. Hi everyone, Dr. Michael Clapper here announcing our new format for our Q&A with Dr. K. Each day, Annie Hagen will be asking me one question that's been sent in by our viewers. So if you want to see if your question is getting answered, do join us for our daily Q&A with Dr. K right here. Hope to see you then.